Consider the reaction sequence below. In step one, compound A is produced by the reaction of methyl benzene with concentrated nitric acid and concentrated sulfuric acid. Initially, the nitric and sulfuric acid react uh, to form an intermediate. Uh, right, okay, so it's given equation to show the formation of the intermediate uh, form between nitric acid and sulfuric acid. So the wording is a bit odd there, but it is essentially the reaction between uh, nitric acid and sulfuric acid, and you should know your mechanisms. So this makes the NO2 plus plus HSO4 minus plus H2O. The name of this mechanism is electrophilic substitution. And then the mechanism here, so don't forget to put the methyl on, that's going to cost you a mark when you get to the intermediate if you forget that. So here we go, so NO2, positive charges on the nitrogen, so from the ring to the uh, positive nitrogen here, that's going to be one of the marks for the mechanism. That's going to give me my intermediate. So now I've got to make sure I put it in the right place, so back to here, so it's in the opposite position. So it's going to go there, and I need a hydrogen as well. And remember, I can't delocalize around there, so I'm going to have partial delocalization around the rest of them. So one mark for the correctly drawn intermediate, and then the final mark is for the curly arrow from the middle of the carbon-hydrogen bond back into the uh, ring. Just to finish that off then, product is there. Okay. In step four, compound B reacts with methanol. So let me go back to that. So step four, so B reacts with methanol. So that's an alcohol, and that's going to react with the carboxylic acid up here. Okay. Uh, in the presence of a small amount of sulfuric acid, <clears throat> that's the catalyst. Draw the structure of the compound. So um, hopefully you remember that we take the OH off the carboxylic acid, we take the hydrogen off there, and then that oxygen will join to that carbon there. So I'm going to make um, an ester here. Okay. So, so don't forget the NO2 is here, and then CO, so the OH has come off, that's joined on the oxygen that's on the methanol, which gives me that. So if I just put the red dots in where, where it would have joined, that's where it would have joined, and of course we've uh, uh, eliminated water with that one. Okay? Okay. Compound C is prepared by the reduction of B. So let's go back and have a look. So compound C, so by the reduction, so it is now, it's this that is being reduced. Okay, give the reagents and conditions for step three and complete the equation for uh, the reaction. So here, uh, the reagents and conditions is tin and concentrated hydrochloric acid. So I need both of those for the one mark there. And then if you remember, we put the H in brackets here. So and I'll come back to the H's in a minute because I'm taking two oxygens off here, which means I need two waters over there. Okay, so in total, I've got four hydrogens here, two that are in there, which is gonna give me six which means to balance that I need the six in front of this one here. Okay. And then under the correct conditions, C can polymerize, draw a section of the polymer chain showing two repeat units and name the type of polymerization. Well, there's only two types of polymerization. There's addition and there's uh, condensation. And with an amine at one end, oops, with an amine at one end and a carboxylic acid at the other, this is going to be condensation. So I'll draw two of the monomers and then we'll polymerize it from there. So 
So there's one, let me draw another one over here. And again, it's, it's the same as before. We always cut off the OH off the carboxylic acid and we take one hydrogen off. If it was an alcohol, it'd be off the OH, but this is an amine, so we take a hydrogen off the NH instead. So let me rub all of those bits out that's in there. Okay, so let me join the two together now. I'll draw it in green. So there's a bond between these two here. And I'll just rub out the red lines here so we can see what's left. So there is our polymerization there. Uh, things to note, I do need my bonds at the end here. And this bit here needs to be the amide link in there. Um, 